Hey y'all, woke up yesterday on the fly going to an estate sale at the last minute and I'm glad I did. Let me show you the things that I found at the sale. First things I found was for $2 and mind you everything was marked 75 was 75% 75 off the price. So I'll give you the grand total at the end. I got a set of four Christmas tree napkin ring holders. They're ceramic or porcelain or something but I just think they're really pretty. I think they're really pretty. Nice statement piece for my table. I got these pots and pans by Revereware. Revereware made in the USA. Copper core. Pots and pans look barely used, if at all. This one is a double boiler. Great for when I make my banana pudding. And then I have the matching two more. Sorry, two more copper core pots by Revere Wear. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, nice. Then I have one, and this is a mix up. So when you go to estate sales, please pay attention to everything. Make sure you look at everything. Don't go through there running through. I didn't see anything. Take your time. This is by. Healthcraft. I've never heard of until I bought this yesterday. It was $20, but for 75% off, I got it for $5, $25, something like that. $5. $5. This is 5 ply surgical steel. I don't think this has been used. But I know the selling to resell these, the rate is high, so that's why I got it. And I have another channel for all that stuff. But anyway, the mix up was someone put the Revere Wear Copper Core top lid on it. So the price for whatever went to this was six dollars, and they kind of they they um didn't honor this price because of the mix up. So I kind of got lucky, and then this made my whole trip was the Waterford decanter. Look at that, y'all! That base is big as my hand. Look at this decanter. Look at that cut in that crystal. The only thing with this decanter was it did not come with a lid. Well, the stopper, but that's fine because I can find one. Trust me, I can. It was $75, but it came to $18.75. Made it all worth it. And then I got this, I thought was a dresser set. This is MNZ Austria Porcelain. I thought it was a dresser set. A dish. A lid to a dish. One napkin ring holder. And two trays. There are two trays here. I'm just going to keep them together for because they clank. There are two trays here. This is why I say you have to go through the entire cell and make sure you see everything. There was a whole entire, and this is pre-1909. There was a whole entire china set to match this. But this is in the bedroom because the person used it as a dresser set. And the china got away from me. So, whatever. Anyway, this is... um. What do you want to call these? This is a salt and pepper shaker, reproduction, silver plated by Sheffield. By community, I'm sorry, Sheffield Design Reproduction by Community. These sell brand new for $70 on eBay. It was $2 yesterday, so with 75% off, I paid 50 cents for the both of them. Has a nice leaf and stem design at the tops. Salt and pepper shakers. This is why, again, I say make sure you see everything. I would have passed this up. Okay, so after we left the state sale, we went to the Goodwill. And at the Goodwill, I found two crystal glasses. Not sure if they're Waterford because there's no mark. I'm still doing the research on them. Listen to that. These were 89 cents each. Now, I bought the two of them because I've had this happen to me time and time again. And I'll explain that on this next one I found. Yee hee hee. Don't want to break those. I found one single glass. No etch in it that I can find as of yet. Look at that design. Look at those cuts. Listen to that music. I bought this one single glass for the simple fact. There have been times that I've been in Goodwill 
and I saw one something or two something. And then I go back a month or two later and find the rest. So I'm waiting for these. But all together yesterday I spent, I have it all wrote down somewhere here. $46 for a Waterford decanter to be included in my haul. That's pretty darn good. Thank you until the next video. Happy thrifting. Build your home on thrift as I have.